Hey everyone, welcome to uh, my online courses. Uh, I'm going to do one tutorial for both my online section and my day section. They look exactly the same. So uh, for my online students, don't worry about it. This is the day section, but they're exactly the same. First thing I want you guys to do is you go to the welcome start here first. This is where you would go to get the lesson files from your book. Uh, classroom and a book from Photoshop. You go to Peach Pit. You put in the book that you're using, the ISBN number, and you'll see lesson and update files. Here's all your lesson files. So for each lesson of the book, there's files that you have to download. You can do them all at once or do them one at a time. I'd do it all at once, just spend like a day downloading all of them. These are what you're going to turn in each week are these lesson files. All right. So if you look under weekly lessons, you'll see you have week one has an overview kind of goes through and tells you a little bit about Photoshop there's videos that you can watch nothing really do during uh, week one except to go to the discussion board so all this week all you need to do is go to the discussion board for the first week but like week two what you'll see is to turn in the complete lesson file for uh, the book here's some more videos that you can watch that go along with this lesson so if you click on week two, let me remind you again, you actually have to click on the text that says week two. So you have to click right here. And it's going to show you the due date. Okay, so it's going to be due Sunday, September 7th. 10 p.m. All of the lessons and projects for the semester are going to be due on Sundays. So when you do the lesson, you'll be finished with a Photoshop file. Always turn in Photoshop files. I don't want to see any JPEGs or anything like that. Uh, if you turn in a JPEG, it's a zero uh, because I can't grade it. I can't see any of the layers or anything in Photoshop. So when you're ready to turn it in, it's just like email. If you're going to send an attachment, you click Browse My Computer. and I would have a folder just for this class. You see my desktop is very cluttered. Um, but you would locate the PSD files and you see their .psd and you open it. Sometimes the files can be kind of big too so just be prepared for that. It might take a little while, especially the projects. And when you're done you'd hit this little button submit here. It's also up top. Submit. Once you submit it, it goes into the gradebook and I can grade it. Same thing with the semester projects. You go to project one, click it. All right, it tells you when it's due. And you have this little attachment here. Now you're gonna open this in Photoshop. So you're gonna save it to your desktop. Do a save link as. Save it to the desktop, and then you're going to open that file in Photoshop and start working on it. If you just click it, it's just going to open up in your browser, kind of like this. Can't do a whole lot with it. So make sure to open the file in Photoshop. And the same thing, once you're done, browse by computer, find the file, and attach it. So for this first project, what you'll see is a link over here saying video and PDF tutorials. There's a lot of information over here. So if you click on it, you'll see this little folder for business card. Click on that and you'll see a couple tutorials on how to create the business card. So it's step by step. Of course, you're going to do your own thing. Have some fun with it. Remember, this is all to be designed in Photoshop. No photos. No photos on here, just all Photoshop tools. And this tutorial will show you how to do that. All right. If click back over on that video PDF tutorials, uh, one of the projects is an album cover. This kind of shows you how to do that. But you also see um, 
different tutorials for most of the tools that we use in Photoshop. So you're just going to have to kind of go through these on your own, but it will help you out throughout the semester. On the syllabus, you'll have my contact information. Best way to get a hold of me is to email me. Okay. Uh, I'm running around a lot, so I don't always check my phone messages, but if you email me, I will get back to you very, very quickly. Uh, if you don't hear from me, it might be that the email didn't go through. Uh, email me again. Don't worry about that. You're not bugging me. Uh, I have a lot of classes, a lot of students, so if I don't respond to you within a day, email me again. This is the book you're using, Classroom Book, ISBN number. Okay, I'm here on campus Monday through Friday. Uh, I usually work about 40 hours a week. Fridays are really good days. If you want to come in and make an appointment, just come in and talk to me about something. You can read through the syllabus on your own. You'll see the grading system. Each one of the chapters are worth 10 points. Okay, So the chapter lessons, you can miss a few of them and it doesn't affect your grade too much. What you want to really get done and do well are the projects who are worth 100 points each. You miss one of those it'll drop you down a grade okay assignments and projects deadline policy weekly lessons will not be accepted okay if they're turned in after the deadline okay I know during the first week it's kind of tough that's why you don't have a lesson from the book but after that first week I will not accept any lessons from the book turned in it's an automatic zero projects will be accepted up to five days late after the deadline however you'll get a 10 point deduction per day that they're late. So five days is a 50 point deduction. Anything after five days, it's just a zero. So if you have any questions, email me. Uh, this website project's hidden from you guys, so you won't be able to see that. That comes later in the semester. That's like your last um, assignment, discussions. Okay. You'll see the first week of class. You click on it, and you'd create a new thread. Click on this. And it's kind of like typing up an email. Just put in the subject, hey, this is who I am. And in the message, you can just tell us a little bit about yourself and why you're taking the class. What do you expect out of it? When you're done, hit submit. This is worth 10 points, and it's how I make sure that you have uh, logged in and done something in this course. It's how I certify the courses. If I don't get a uh, thread from a student, then you will not be certified for the course that you have attended. So if you have any questions, email me. I look forward to a good semester and I'll see the, my day class students on Monday. Remember, online students, you can always come in and sit in on any of the lectures. Uh, the day class is Mondays and Wednesdays at 9.15. So feel free if you're getting behind or you need some extra help, you can come in. Uh, I'm here 40 hours a week, so you can always schedule time to come in and see me. Uh, the drop date is November 13th. So come talk to me if you're thinking about dropping the class. We might be able to uh, help you out. And uh, look forward to working with you guys this semester. Thanks.